Um, it's an interesting question. What would I change within the art world? You know, I, I think that the thing about the art world that I love is that um, is the stories mm -hmm. um, from the art world. You know, it's like great paintings, great art, you know, tends to have an extraordinary narrative, you know, behind it. And, you know, I, I really love the storytelling aspect of art, um, you know, versus, you know, sometimes the more intellectual academic um, perspective mm -hmm. uh, around, you know, particular pieces of art. You know, I think that, you know, storytelling is a way to make things much more accessible and engaging. You know, I'm a storyteller by nature. I, I respond to that, um, you know, as opposed to, you know, kind of certain things about why something is important or extraordinary. And, you know, I, I would love to really see, you know, more people embrace that, you know, to go ahead and, you know, make it, um, a, you know, even to create even greater accessibility and understanding about why something is important um, and also why something um, is either timeless or sometimes of its time. You know, I think that those are really hard, hard questions. And, you know, what makes somebody, um, what, what makes something great um, as opposed to, you know, what's interesting at a particular moment in time. Yeah, you know, music goes through that, literature goes through that, film goes through that. You know, we, we all kind of grapple with, is this thing going to be really extraordinary and powerful 50 years from now? Right. You know, or is it just something that, you know, you know, kind of, you know, has an impact at this moment and, you know, then, you know, we go live to see another day.